In terms of supplies, you're going to need to find some kind of white lacy undershirt and then a purple jacket or blazer. Both items are relatively easy to find at any thrift store. In total, I only spent $10.63 for everything I needed. The first thing I'm going to make is the ruffles. So to make those, I just used some white fabric that I found at the thrift store. I believe it's a scarf, but any thin white fabric will work. So you're going to want to cut about the length of a cookie sheet's worth of fabric. And then once you've got that all laid out, you're going to want to cut it into three equal sections. Also, don't throw out the excess fabric because you're going to need that for later when you make the necktie. So this does require some minimal sewing. Now, just a forewarning, I don't have any formal sewing training whatsoever outside of what I learned in home at in high school, all right? So all you need to do is thread a needle and then you're going to take it and go over and under all the way throughout the length of the fabric. So once you've sewn all the way to the end of the fabric, you're going to pull on the thread and it should start to scrunch up and then you'll add a few extra stitches at the end to make sure it doesn't come undone. And then you'll just do that same process for the other two pieces of fabric that you cut as well. Now at this point you're probably thinking, um, what the hell is he going to do with those used tissues? Because that's exactly what I was thinking. But I made it work by just stacking them on top of each other and then using a safety pin to hold them together. So for the hair, I'm just going to do a braid out by taking down the box braids I put in last week. If you're interested in learning how to do that, I have a tutorial up on my page, so check that out. And of course, if you don't have long hair, you can always go purchase a wig. So after I finish taking all those down, I'm just going to go ahead and flip my hair to one side and then I'm going to use bobby pins to hold it in place. Once I've got my hair situated, I'm going to go ahead and take the excess fabric from earlier that I made the ruffles out of and wrap that around my neck like a scarf. After that, I'm going to take the ruffles I made and then attach them to the scarf with safety pins. And then if you want to be extra at the end, you can go ahead and add some eyeliner. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the costume. I did decide to go with black pants because I could not find any purple ones at the thrift store, but I'm still very pleased with how it came out. If you guys enjoyed this video or found it helpful, be sure to thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next one.